Well, starting this year, all high schools in the Caddo Parish School District are offering online courses. It's a program that helps students prepare for college. And as News Channel 6's Maria Vallejo tells us, it also allows students access to courses that would otherwise be unavailable to them. Brittany Murrow is recovering from a serious car accident. She missed a full semester of school. Murrow's catching up on work missed through online courses offered at Northwood High School. With this class, it lets you start from the very beginning. Teachers from across the state are always online to help students, even if they're not in the same city. And a certified teacher is in the computer lab every day to supervise the progress. But those taking the courses say even with the extra help, dedication is key in this classroom. But if you're not disciplined, there's no, no hope for you. You can work at your own pace at it. You don't have someone standing over you pressuring you. A lesson in responsibility teachers believe will help these students prepare for the future. Once they get to college, they can be offered online classes through college as well. And with technology changing as quickly as it does, introducing new concepts and ideas in the classroom is the best way to keep up with the changing times. I guess to keep it interactive and to keep the students involved and interested. We have to keep up with what's out there. It's the wave of the future in education. In Shreveport, Maria Viejo, KTAL News Channel 6. The Caddo Parish School District is also working on setting up a program called Distance Learning, where students and teachers will be able to have video conferences with each other. Day in Baton Rouge. In a few weeks, students at Caddo's Northwood High School will begin using the latest computer technology. Math teacher Susan Tompkins will bring this new technology to her 10th, 11th, and 12th graders because she is our latest winner of $1,000 thanks to KTBS 3 and UPN 21's One Class at a Time. <laughs> We surprised Ms. Thompson this afternoon and her students were pretty excited too because she's talked with them about the new Triangle Project that will give each student their own remote control to answer questions in the classroom setting. Not everybody's comfortable giving a verbal response out loud and actually I was one of those students you know, in high school as well. And so this would be a way for somebody to be confident in answering a question, attempting the question, and not anybody in the class knowing exactly how the response was. Good. And it will be recorded for me. Good. And it gets instant feedback and it just, it's just going to be so great. Y'all are just going to love it. We're set to make another check presentation next Friday. You'll see it here at 6.